Welcome all, Papa G here. Today I present my chili cheese dog casserole. This casserole encompasses all the flavors of a traditional chili cheese dog without the worry of all the carbs. The only thing missing besides the bun is a ball game in front of it. Let's get started. We'll start with our chili sauce by adding some ground beef to a saute pan on medium high heat. Break it up a bit and add some diced green onions and bell pepper. Continue to break up the beef as it cooks. Once the beef is browned, drain and return to the pan. Reduce the heat to medium low and add some salt, ground black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, a sugar substitute equal to one tablespoon of sugar, vinegar, some Worcestershire sauce, about a third of a cup of zero sugar ketchup, and finally a little yellow mustard. Stir in and cook for about three minutes. Turn off the heat while we construct our casserole. For the best results, use a quality hot dog like Nathan's or Hebrew National. Just make sure it's all beef. How you cut your hot dogs are totally up to you, but I like to slice them long ways and then cut them about an inch in size. Once all the hot dogs are cut, add them to an 8 by 11 inch casserole dish and spread them as evenly as possible to cover the bottom. Next, layer about 4 ounces of shredded cheddar cheese over the hot dogs. Now pour over our chili sauce and evenly distribute it over the dish. Add about a half a cup of diced raw onions over the chili sauce. Now add about a cup of drained sauerkraut over the top. Next, some dill relish over the sauerkraut. Be sure it's dill relish and not the sweet variety. Finish with another four ounces of shredded cheddar cheese over the top. Place in the middle of a preheated 400 degree oven for 12 to 15 minutes. Remove and let cool just a bit. Serve hot and enjoy all the flavors of a traditional chili cheese dog in an easy to make casserole. There you have it folks, my chili cheese dog casserole. All the flavors of a traditional chili cheese dog without all the carbs. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and consider subscribing. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.